Good evening from Washington, D.C., and thank you to those of you joining us from around the world for news from a Catholic perspective. I'm Lauren Ashburn. Police in Turkey say they are one step closer to figuring out what happened to a missing Saudi journalist. The country's president says investigators found evidence a prominent contributor to the Washington Post was killed while inside the Saudi consulate in Istanbul. Correspondent Wyatt Goolsby joins us with details. Good evening, Wyatt. Good evening, Lauren. Investigators in Turkey are also taking a look at Saudi consul's personal residence tonight. In the midst of the investigation, the Saudi diplomat himself has left Turkey, flying back to Saudi Arabia. That's where Secretary of State Mike Pompeo is looking for answers in the case of the missing journalist, Jamal Khashoggi. Secretary Pompeo not wasting any time after his arrival in Riyadh, shaking hands with Saudi Arabia's foreign affairs minister before traveling to a royal palace where King Salman greeted him. America's top diplomat thanking the king for accepting his visit on behalf of President Trump. We're working very close with Saudi Arabia and with Turkey, and they are working together to figure out what happened. The president sending the secretary of state to Saudi Arabia comes just two weeks after Jamal Khashoggi was last seen entering the Saudi consulate to pick up some paperwork and never came out. World leaders, including the United Nations Human Rights Commission, have called for lifting of any immunity at the consulate so that investigators can do a full search. It seems very probable some, some crime or other has been committed. Uh, we, we all need to know what it was. Turkey's president blamed Saudi Arabia, accusing the Saudi government of having the 60-year-old murdered. Pompeo met with Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman, who rejects Turkey's allegations. Khashoggi wrote critically about the prince as a contributor for the Washington Post while living in the United States. The prince stressing the U.S.-Saudi alliance today, telling Pompeo, we are strong and old allies. James Carafano, a national security expert, notes the growing rift between Turkey and Saudi Arabia. He says it's vital the United States plays a leadership role in the Middle East. The United States has a specific interest in that peace and stability in the Middle East is critical and in many respects, the United States is the only respected power that has the capacity and the capability, in a sense, to mitigate these contentious relationships. Some media reports suggest Khashoggi may have been killed during a botched interrogation inside the Saudi consulate, but officials have not confirmed that. Secretary Mike Pompeo will likely learn more tomorrow. That's when he travels to Turkey to meet with their foreign minister about the investigation. He's also welcoming Turkey's decision to release evangelical pastor Andrew Brunson, who is back home in the United States. Lauren? Mike Goolsby reporting. Thank you, Wyatt.